Hey there, bug watchers. Welcome back to BuggyBot Plays XCOM The Long War. So, we just got our first terror mission, guys. Not everybody was ready, but uh, so we're pulling some people out of here with fatigue. But it looks like we're going to be decently prepared to do this. Now, we don't have laser weapons, which is unfortunate. I was really hoping to have laser weapons before this point. But, uh, I think we can make it anyway. So let's cross our fingers and hope for some good luck. Now, you'll notice I have a lot of flashbangs. That's mostly because if I run into a bunch of chrysalids, my goal is to slow them down as much as possible. Oh man, did we get an unfortunate an unfortunate terror attack map. Oh my god. Guys, I have to... This is going to be a difficult mission. This is going to take a lot of thinking. Oh boy. How bad is this going to be? Alright, we're in our typical starting point. We don't have... We don't have the high ground yet. Oh, man. I'll be honest, guys. This this scares the crap out of me. This is a tough place to fight. So here's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking we take this building very quickly. Uh, we don't seem to have any immediate contact, which I think is pretty lucky. And I feel like we have a decent chance to win this if I can get my soldiers up high where they can abuse the terrain to take out any uh, chrysalids that happen to come at us. Oh boy. There's our first set already. Yeah! Pen Hollow. I think we just activated two different squads, though, or two different pods. So there's two. Who else? Did these guys activate? I don't think they... I don't know if they did. I actually have no idea. Well... I'm looking at this, and I think I've actually got a decent chance to flat out kill these guys before they have a chance to do anything. We're going to take it. We're going to take this chance. You have a 2% shot. You, 60%. We are. Yeah, Pen Hollow. You get on it, girl. Um, blinding is going to take a shot. Yeah. All right. To find out if we've actually activated that second pod, I'm gonna put my guys on Overwatch for this round. And basically just hope that I didn't. Because if I did, they're going to come at me with a vengeance. I don't think I did. Oh, there's one. Yeah, okay. They definitely activated. But they're not in... They're not in actual decent firing range. Excellent. This is very good for us. Blinding is on it. Damn. I'll get him next time. I'm not sure there's going to be a next time, buddy. We're in a pretty ugly position here. And there's another pod. Okay, I may just rocket that. If they all clump together, that's going to be a rocket node, just right off the bat. Oh, yeah. 
Pen Hollow. That is your call to service. Um, if there's a civvy in there, well, that's kind of more their problem than mine. Come on. Come on. I think that'll do it. Confirm, yeah. Sorry, civilian. You're pretty much dead anyway, as far as I'm concerned. You are gone. Awesome. Now, you have a flank, but you're not quite... You can't quite reach him. You have an 80% shot. I'm gonna take it. There we are. And now we need to just kill him. What's our movement like? Can you see this guy? Yes, you can. If I move you here, can you see this guy? You cannot. So this may actually be a point where I have to run and gun. This is dangerous. This is incredibly dangerous because there's a lot here that can come at me. There we go. Now I have 74% on him and 100% on him. Don't have a chance to go there. However, I can move up and take that shot. So, the plan is to move forward, take this shot. Very good. All right, yeah, we've got this. Okay. We're going to follow that up by stepping forward with main character, popping a grenade right on him. We're going to put it actually right here just to be sure that we hit him because I'm afraid of it. I've had more than once in this, this even in this particular campaign where I've thrown a grenade and it, it got stuck in a wall and did no damage to anyone. All right, that's two pods down. Here's our third. Looks like two chrysalids and two zombies. That's not actually too bad. I'm I'm not actually afraid of that. At least not terribly afraid. And I think we just hit one of the chrysalids very hard. We did. Very good. Very good indeed. Okay. So what are we going to do? Um we take the 78%. No luck. It's understandable. It's all right. It's okay. We can still take this just fine. There's no need to panic yet. I may be panicking a little bit, guys. We're going to take this shot. And we're going to miss again. Oh my god. Don't do this to me. Don't make this don't make this the time when things go all kinds of wrong, folks. We're, we're better than this. We're a better squad. Honest to goodness. That's it. That's it. Deal the damage. Deal the damage. Um, you're going to back up. Now, you have a 68% chance to kill this guy. 55, 76. You're going to take a shot. Good lord, this chrysalid is driving me insane. Kill that chrysalid. Thank you. Thank you. All right, now we're in now we're in good position. From here, I'm pretty sure we can be we'll be pretty fairly safe. And there's only two zombies left. Okay. Kablam. Yeah, we can take care of this. You know, for the first terror mission so far, while that, that floater pod pop was scary, we could have had a lot worse. 
So I'm feeling I'm feeling good overall about all this. Um, we just have to make sure that feeling continues to be there, because we are running low on ammo. Uh, not everyone's loaded up. Things could still go wrong. Now. I have one shot, two shots, three shots. Okay, I think I'll be okay. I think we just 100% everything else. We make sure that we are going to hit no matter what. There we go. And now you. Excellent. Wow, that was actually a really short mission. Only 12 aliens, uh, 13 civilians saved. And honestly, that went fairly smoothly. So I, I'm kind of happy about that. That's a pretty good score for the first terror mission. Um, even without the beam weapons. So I feel good. I'm, I'm pretty happy about that. I think, I think we did a, a pretty lucky one there. I, I did not expect things to go quite so well. Um, we did take wounds because our soldiers, you know, we took out several of them who were very who are just hours away from being ready to go for the next one which just oh how aggravating is that but we needed it um brew collar droid close combat specialist i like it let's get ccs and doom guy now doom guy what are we gonna do with you i could turn you into an overwatch guy and i'm really tempted I think I'll make you a Shredder guy instead. So I'm going to take Flush. Um, after taking costly action, any shots taken with a sniper rifle after using any costly action, except for minus 10 for Rocketeers. Here we are. Reduces the aim penalty for launching a rocket after taking a costly action. I think we use that. I think that's pretty invaluable on on uh, Pen Hollow. I'd consider Fire in the Hole because it's really good for that scatter. But Pen Hollow has pretty high aim to begin with. I think we'll do pretty I think we'll do just fine with snapshot. So we're gonna go with that. Um, finally blinding dark. Oh yeah Blinding Dark is all the way to Sergeant. How good does that feel? I think... Oh, this is always a tough choice for me because... I really like Deadeye. I love it, in fact. It is an amazing ability. And among the most deadly enemies are the ones that, that fly around and are hard to hit and I'll constantly gain that half cover. This essentially eliminates half the half cover which is really great i mean how fantastic is that the other thing though is that i could really use suppression it's it's just a tough choice um i'm building him as an overwatch specialist i think i'll give him suppression and what i'll do with the other guy i, th I believe is zack sauce who i'm making into a critical specialist i'll give him executioner aggression, and then I'll give him that, so that he hits constantly. So, five floater corpses, Illyrium, a little bit of meld. That was a fantastic mission. Let's let's see what we ended up with in terms of, you know, that's all we've got. That That's all that really happened. This is a really good this is really good.
you know, for the for the end of the second month, we've got almost no panic. We kick the crap out of that terror mission. I think we're in a great position right now. I, I really like it. All right, let's see how we go. Engineers. Oh, I could really do this. You know what? Yes, let's let's get that engineer. We we can afford it, and I really want to. Um, power generator complete. Awesome. We got a power generator. Let me see the let me see the construction. May have been true after all. They're not just here for abductions. They have something else in mind. So we got our power generator. I'd like to get the steam vent built upon when we get the chance, but I haven't haven't quite gotten to do that yet. The new engineers arrived this morning, Commander. We're always Fantastic. glad to have them here. Twelve hours and we get laser rifles, guys. Laser rifles. Ooh We got the Pew Pews. We're totally ready for Pew Pews. Oh man, I'm so excited. And you gave me this. Now you're just you're just teasing me, game. You just teasing me. We're receiving several urgent requests for assistance. All right. In progress at each marked site on the Hologlobe. Off to the UK then. Urban blocks, several buildings, and large combat zone. Awesome. And that's beautiful. Soaring Circus has been named Princess. Oh, you. Hey, Ascarian is back out in the field. Way to go, buddy. Shaking it off. Um... Got a few other good ones in here too. I think we're gonna take Soaring Circus. I'm gonna I'm gonna keep working on her as one of our better uh, our better options among among the gunners. Now the question is, do I? What are we gonna do with Escarian and Juan? I think I'm gonna take them both actually. I could use either one as a decent scout, and running them with shotguns. I feel like gives me a pretty good chance to, to get a lot of flanks on this particular mission. Um, Zaxos, we could bring him into the field. And I think we definitely are going to have to take a... Uh, we're going to have to take a rookie. All right, let's, let's get Zaxos in here. Let's get a rookie. Who's our rookie? Gavino's got pretty good aim. And I'm kind of interested in that. Let's see how he does. And finally, let's take... Hmm. <laughs> let's take Scratch and Sniff. We could use another Rocketeer with some with some experience under their belt. Um, okay, there's no back button, but that's all right. We'll just we'll use Escape here. I think she's I think Soaring Circus is well equipped. We're gonna make some items available real fast too. Now, for a scout, I'm kind of I, I kind of like. How Juan is set up. She's got a good selection here. I think we keep her as she is. As Carrion, honestly, he could use a scope to help keep him on target. Sexos, you're pretty well equipped. I like you right now. Unsung hero, buddy, what are we gonna do with you? Um I think you're just medic and scope. Med kits and scope. That should do just fine for you. Now Gavino. Hate to say it, buddy, but your aim's crap, so we're gonna fix that. We're gonna keep the grenade on you. And then we're gonna have our friend Scratch and Sniff here with let's see we're gonna give her a couple we're just gonna make you go full explosives you're our you're our cover destroyer 
at any given time. All right, I actually may swap out some things. Um, I'm gonna swap out. I think I'll give, give I think I'll give unsung hero something else so that we can give that scope. So that we can give that scope to. So we can give it to. Blah, sorry guys. We're gonna give that scope to hamster. And I think that's a I think that's a smart thing to do here. You know, if we're gonna if we're gonna have it, I'd like explosives that I can really rely on. Especially if we're gonna commit so heavily. It's several blocks in large combat zone. Alright. Okay, well, after that terror mission, I'm feeling good, guys. Um, I really hope you enjoyed the I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, feel free to leave a like. You can subscribe for content every Monday through Friday, and I hope I see you in the next one.